Hey 17, it's Trini Galloway, and I'm here to do another tutorial. This time I'm going to be doing Katarina Graham from my favorite show, Vampire Diaries. I was looking and I found a picture of her at some event, I'm not sure exactly which event it was, but she had a very nice um, pink, pinkish, purplish look on her eyes and a side bun with swooped bangs. So yeah, if you want to see how I did this, keep watching. So first I'm going to be applying my base. And to really get an intense pinkish purple color like she has, I'm going to be applying another base um, that's like a peachy pink color. So now I'm just going to be applying a purple eyeshadow all onto the my eyelid and I'm going to apply that just above my crease. Now using a really light brown, I'm just going to blend this color up into my crease so it doesn't have such a harsh line. And also from my inner corner to about halfway, I'm just going to um, blend in a darker color, like a grayish charcoal color. Next, using another blending brush, I'm going to be applying um, another purple and a lighter pink blended together. Um, I'm going to be applying that on my outer corner and above my crease. Using a small eyeshadow brush, I'm going to be applying black eyeshadow just above my lash line and a little bit in my outer corner. Now I'm going to be applying black um, eye pencil to my lower lash line. I forgot to put my highlight, so we're going to put a highlight. First I'm going to put the highlight on the brow bone. And then using a smaller brush, I'm going to put the highlight in my inner corner. Now I'm going to be applying a black gel liner to my upper lash line. Now on my lower lash line, I'm going to be applying a dark purple eyeliner. The next step is to apply the lashes. So I'm just going to apply the glue and then let it sit a little so it gets really sticky. And just get it as close to your lashes as possible. Well, I already have foundation and concealer on already. Um, so I'll just skip ahead onto the cheeks. I noticed that in the picture she has, it's pretty defined, like a contour here, and then a nice, like, light, shimmery, not really shimmery, but a softer color on top. So I'm going to be applying two blushes. The first one is more of a bronzy, brownish color. I'm going to be applying a peachy pinkish color. It's a really soft color. It's really pretty. I'm just going to apply that onto the apples of my cheeks. And I'm going to blend it into the other blush that I just applied. Now for the lips. Her lips are very nude, but there is like a slight hint of pink in there. So to get that pink, I'm going to apply a pinkish lipstick. It's a very soft lipstick. And on top of that, I'm going to be applying a nude, pinkish, brownish lip gloss. So just like that. So that's the makeup. Let's move on to hair. Now for the hair, um, she has a lot of bangs and a bun to the side. 
So let's go ahead and get started. I'm just going to get my bangs separated like this. So with the rest of my hair, I'm just going to pull it back and to the side. So we're going to perfect this bun before we worry about the bangs. So I've gotten my bun by just spinning the hair around, twirling it up. So now I'm going to move on to the bangs. And I'm just going to pin the bangs back. Shorter bangs, I'm just going to be spraying some hairspray and brushing them to keep them in place. And that's the look. Thanks for watching. Bye.